Hi guys, Steve here at Pump Ponics. Today we're going to talk about algae control and the fish tanks. Now here we have a bunch of smaller plecos. Uh, these are the biggest ones that we could find. Um, they're about six, four, between four and six inches in here. Um, and we're going to put them one in each of these tanks. We're going to also keep picking up a few more on Craigslist uh, as we can find some big ones. But you can see this sucker mouth here. They'll hang on to the sides of your tank and eat the algae and all the different stuff that grows on the sides. You can look down in there and see. Well, you can't see all that well, but uh, below the surface there is a little bit of algae. There you go, you can see some on the center pole there. Um, and they'll, they'll do a great job of just feeding on that. We have one in here already. Uh, occasionally they'll come hang out on the glass. I don't see any either one on the glass right now, but uh, we do have them there eventually, sometimes. So, alrighty, so we're gonna release these guys one at a time into these back couple, back three tanks that need them still. And uh, yeah, if you're out there and you're wondering what can I do to make less maintenance or keep the tanks cleaner, these little guys here, these plecos or plecostomuses, are a great option. That often you can find large ones on Craigslist that are uh, need need good new homes, and your aquaponic system can be a great way to. Uh, Give them a great place to be that's not overly cramped like many people's aquariums are uh, when they buy the wrong type of bleco. Alrighty, thanks a lot for watching. Sure to hit that like and subscribe button if you enjoy this content. Take care, and we'll catch you again next time.